Hi guys, it's Pink Vision Terry here and I'm doing a reading for Aquarius for um, September 2020. Oh, Magician Reverse, not a great energy. That's why I felt like I needed to sage probably. So just did fire signs. Um, that was heavy energy. So let's see if we can get it a bit um, bit lighter. So it'll be a general reading. It Take what resonates, leave the rest. Okay. So Aquarius, Aquarius, what do you need to know? Aquarius, what do you need to know? Yeah, page of Wands reversed. Not a great start. You've got a fire sign around you that's just an idiot. Immature. Needs a real kick up the ass. So that is that what you're dealing with this um, month? Stupid fire sign. Oh, here we go. The devil, Capricorn. Great. This is why I had to sage because the energy is just so, it's just a lot of toxic energy, a lot of to toxic masculinity um, being exposed and coming out. Um, Aquarius. Could be dealing with the Capricorn, which is an earth sign, but it just could be, you know, just a addictions, um, mental health issues. Sorry. Um, abuse. Abuse. Immature energy. Someone not wanting to take responsibility for their actions. You know, that's sort of what I get. You know, the page of wands. It could be a kid just acting up, getting into some stupid stuff that you have to address. Or it just could be, you know, an immature person that you, you know or family member. That needs a bit of a kick up the ass. Or more than that, they might need to have to go to rehab or like, it, you know, we'll see what else there is, but just that energy. Um, three of Swords reverse, so it could be someone that you dated and that broke your heart. Maybe they're reappearing in your life in September. But, you know, the um, Three of Swords reverse is an energy of, of it being in the past. So whatever this person's done, it was in the past. But maybe they want to go for round two unfortunately so you know this might be a warning that this person wants to come back to finish the job or um, cause some more heartache yep tower reversed so this person wants to come back in and, and shake things up again and just you know create the same bullshit they did last time they were around so Aquarius um, you know this um, that's why I knew I had to say is, you know these these people just don't want to you know leave you alone, you know, um, it's obsession, nine of wands reversed, you know, it's taken time to get over what this person did, mentally, emotionally, possibly even physically, physical abuse, battling demons, this person's battling demons, which made you battle demons, you know, but you've worked hard to move on from this. I feel like this person wants to come back and um, do the same thing again. Ten of Wands, reverse. It's about family. Maybe you lost money because of this person. You lost money because of this person. Or something's happening to this person in September and you find out about it. Maybe to do with losing money. Queen of Wands, reverse. Yeah, it's fire sign energy. Um could be a female that you're dealing with, um, could be a male, but um, toxic, someone who will cheat on you and then just abusive, abusive, strength card reverse could be dealing with a Leo too, so it's it's been a tough road, and I almost get that energy of you felt like giving up sometimes, but you know, yeah, again, just this, it's this addiction, this person has just been a burden. This person or addiction has been a burden. So if it's an addiction, you know, you might, you know, after being sober for ages, might need to make sure that you don't slip into old habits. If you bump into someone from the past, that's still into the same thing. You know, that's what it could be because you could relapse. This person you know could relapse. This person might come back to just try and create the same bullshit that they did in the past. 
eight of pentacles reverse someone could be coming back because yeah they don't have any any options the money's dried up the money's dried up yeah five of cups reversed the empress the three of um wands almost this person from the past could have gotten someone pregnant and um they're trapped now and they might be coming to you to tell you but you don't care death card it's over so why come back and tell you um ace of cups reverse there's just no emotional connection anymore this person you know might um if it is an addiction they might I don't want to say it but there could be an overdose or there could be some kind of event that happens that um, leads to oh, um, you know you can your body's an amazing machine but there's only so much it can take and, and it can be abused and abused and abused but then one day you know it can just give out so you know if someone's battling addictions their body could start to give out if this abusive person's got someone pregnant they might come back and tell you but you know oh well never mind <laughs> you know they're trapped now for 18 years you know 10 9 you know like 19 years trapped now they have to financially pay for this kid and that's a form of their karma because you know maybe you are in a position where you don't have to worry about that anymore so you know you're yeah I just get the, I just do I get you know there's a few messages here someone toxic from the past wants to tell you that they've got someone pregnant and um, they think it might hurt you hearing that but it actually will probably make you laugh and laugh out loud because they're trapped now for another 18 19 years having to pay so they'll be you know older and you're actually on the other side of that now and you can travel and this is upright for you you're thinking about the next move and this person's now trapped they can't go anywhere because they've got to pay for a kid that they probably don't want because this person's looking really sad oh well never mind lack of money oh so it's either that or, you know, an addiction could lead to a really terrible event for someone. And maybe it's time you have to practice tough love or someone has to practice tough love on you. Maybe you've done that in the past and you might be getting a, um, a call to say that, you know, something's happened or this person who's toxic wants to just come back into your life and just emotionally bait you with the news that they've got someone pregnant. But, you know, there's no love there anymore. But this is what there is for you. <sighs> new beginnings in the middle of chaos. Three aces there. New beginnings in the middle of chaos. That's where you are. And that's how you feel about them. No, not today. And that's what's happening with them too. Oh well. You know, they rushed into something and because they thought the grass was greener broken marriage, broken promises, something from the past that only caused chaos in a family, narcissistic energy and karma. This person could have been quite violent. And look at you there, Aquarius, overcoming it all. So, yeah, I think um, if this person's got someone pregnant, it'll, it, you'll find it really funny. Um, and that's not what they will expect you to um, think or feel. They'll, they'll actually want you to feel lost, but um, you've moved on. Well and truly moved on. So Aquarius might just do an um, oracle card for you t today. Karma plays out in lots of different ways. You know, the universe... Um, you know, sometimes you don't even realize what the universe is doing to manifest this um, disruption for someone that was toxic, you know. People might think, oh, wow, a baby, that's amazing. Well, 
it's not always amazing, especially if you're in a relationship with someone that you don't really love, or you're in a relationship with someone that you um that you abuse, and then there's a baby that's brought into it. Babies make relationships if they're tough and there's no love, having a baby actually makes a relationship worse, and it makes it more toxic, and of course children need things, and they cost a lot of money, so having that as an added pressure, it's not always a blessing for some people, and especially if this person trapped this person into having a baby with them, so what do you need to know Aquarius, guardian angels, know that at all times your way is lit, your body guarded and soul guided, Aquarius, the angels are watching over you, and you're well protected. This is one of the major cards as well in the deck. So you've got spiritual guidance here. You know, the universe is watching. The universe is protecting you. That's why this card's upside down, because the universe has helped you heal from what this person did. And now they're facing um, some tough challenges of their own, and you might get to hear about it this week, okay? So, or this month, I should say. So um, good luck, I say.